when we engage in this fight back and we engage in this counteroffensive, that we recognize that part of what's happening in 2024 is the presidential election. And that I think is really important for us to not let the so-called white liberal Biden and the liberal Democratic Party get away with what they're doing. I think we're going to have to characterize Biden and the, and the white liberal Biden, who himself has an extraordinary record, not just dealing with the uh, the omnibus crime bill that's that's responsible for the the murders of George Floyd and so many other people, uh, but and the the massive imprisonment of African people in this country, but uh, his participation in passing legislation as a senator. Uh, that was opposed to busing, opposed to integration, a thing that the liberals say they believe in, the liberal Democratic Party and the liberal Biden say they believe in, that they sucker African people into voting for them and others as well who are sympathetic to these liberal issues. But I think that the fact that the Biden uh, would put forth, uh, put this army out there uh, to fight against us, to bring uh, armored vehicles and, and flashbang grenades and mounted laser targeting devices on, on, uh, on uh, uh, automatic uh, weapons that uh, hitting me in my chest to let me know that they were prepared to kill me. I think we should say that, and, and based on the fact that we are supposed to be so stupid and me, you know, uh, 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 being involved in this struggle, the party itself is 50 years old, uh, but we are so, African people are so stupid that we have to have Russians or somebody else tell us that we are oppressed. That should be really the means by which we characterize them in the way they like to talk in terms of being racist. It's a racist ploy, it's a racist trope. It plays on the worst uh, uh, assumptions that about white people uh, and about African people, the, about Africans that we're so stupid and about white people that you're so stupid uh, also uh, that, that uh, you would uh, be a gullible enough, but that doesn't work anymore, I'm sure of that. Just looking at how things are unfolding in this country and in this world and people are looking for answers and that's not gonna work, but we need to indict them. Yeah. We need to say this, to, it's the Democratic Party uh, is the, is the uh, uh, Biden, uh, the Democrat, the liberal Democrat, and this is something we need to say all around the country and people need to see that uh, so that the B Biden and the Democratic Party are going to have to concern, be consider, concerned about whether or not they're going to be able to capture the African vote and other votes of people who might be otherwise sympathetic to us and who don't want to be, uh, if you'll pardon uh, the characterization, tarred with that brand uh, uh, of, of being uh, the, the racist uh, that the Biden administration and the Democratic Party uh, have proven themselves to be.